Eyewitness News reporter Carrie Corrado joins us from Spring Garden with a big project that's expected to make a big difference. Carrie? Yuki, good evening. That's right. Millions of dollars is going into this, but the vision is far bigger than the project. The goal is to offer a safe haven to the community. Breaking ground on the future only recreation center. The plan is to turn this into this. The people who live in this community get a sense of pride and hope despite the challenge that we face as it relates to the gun violence epidemic that this city is now facing. With a rash of shootings, the community hopes the new center will help curb the violence, even if it's one small step at a time. With what's going on in Philadelphia right now, uh, we definitely need to give our kids a safe haven. That's well, critically important. I mean, kids need a safe place to play and be around positive adults. They need a place that they're attracted to. The future rec center will have state of the art facilities, something the Alney Eagles always hoped for. The Alney Eagles go and play in the suburbs in a field that has uh, locker rooms and showers and, you know, uh, snack bars and everything else, and, and they come here and we're, we're, not, we're not close to it. In the meantime, the Philadelphia City Council is working to buy new surveillance cameras to the city's rec centers to help police tackle crime, too. But as the construction gets underway, it's safe to say the kids who will be using it are excited. How excited are you to have this? So the goal is to get this rec center done in about a year and a half. We're live in Spring Garden, Carrie Corrado, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Carrie, thank you for that.